Hey guys, Barrett here. I'm really excited to present to you today my Rhino Metals Ironwork Series Safe. It's a 72 long gun safe. It's got a whole bunch of other features and storage I can't wait to share with you. Don't miss out. So one of the first things that you're going to notice about the Ironworks series is that it really looks different than everything else that's on the market, right? It has that old 1850s style look with the external hinges, although you may think that's a security issue. It's not. We'll get to that here in a little bit. So let's go over the specs of this actual safe, um, and then we will look in the inside and talk about why everything on the inside is absolutely protected. So to give you an idea of how big this gun safe is, is I'm six foot and 160 pounds. This is 72 inches, 56 inches wide, 27 inches deep. I could put my whole family in here if they gave me grief. It is massive. It holds 72 uh, long guns, and I've got tons of places to put pistols. But before we get to that, one of the things I do want to comment about this is that I'm not really going to go over a lot of the specs and a lot of the things that you can clearly see and find on their website, but I am going to go over a few key things that were selling points to me. So one of the absolute key features of the safe that was a selling point was the Sergeant Greenleaf EMP resistant keypad lock. Um, my dad always raised me to enjoy the combination lock and I like those things. But dad, I want to get into the safe fast because unlike you, I get into this thing every single day. I open up the safe and I don't want to have to fool with the combination. I want to be able to punch it in, but I want that security in case that there was a solar flare or a nuclear attack upon uh, the United States that this would be something I could get into very quickly. Now, when people first see the safe, they notice the external hinges and they think that this is a safety issue, when in fact it is not, because there are a total of 18 door bolts that go up and into the security corners and portions of the safe around all sides. So even if you think that you're gonna pop these suckers off, the safe door ain't going anywhere. So one of the things that I love about this safe is that I can turn this dial right here after I've entered my combination. And I can open the door at any time, and I can shut the door at any time. And because I've got children, I can turn this, lock that, without turning this back. And when I turn it back, and when I turn this mechanism back, it will lock it. But if it's not turned, guess what? I can turn and return and turn and return. It's only when I lock it that I secure it. So remember to turn it counterclockwise, lock it before you leave. And if all that security wasn't enough, Rhinos has given you the best safe guarantee that's on the market right now. There's free repair or replacement of your safe in the event of a fire. There's free replacement or repair in the attempt of an attempted burglary or an actual burglary. And they go one step beyond and freight cost is covered both to and fro the delivery and the repair of your safe. So if for whatever reason the unfortunate happens, Rhino will replace the safe. Now let's open this bad boy up and show you some goodies. One of the first things you'll notice is that when you open up this bad boy, LED lighting, uh, they can install that stuff for you. That's an added extra on package, but I highly recommend it because you don't want to be fishing throughout here late at night or in low light trying to find whatever it is that you're looking for. It can get dark back here in this back room, so I like the LED lighting kit. It's very, very nice, makes everything really bright, and uh, oh yeah, like a lot. Aside from the lighting is the actual kind of like leather sway that you got going on as far as the, the cabinets and the inserts are concerned. You've got... Uh, a dividing piece here in the center, but then on either side you can really make that into whatever it is that you want. Whatever configurations of shelf or however you want it to do, you can set it up this area for SBRs and this area for long guns or, or whatever it is that you want to do. It's all highly customizable. And then Rhino takes it one step further in the organization department. 
and it has added a swing out feature, a completely patented swing out feature, completely noiseless and silent, in which you can access any of your long guns, your SBRs, your shotguns that you want to. Extreme space saver, I highly recommend this feature. So I've got a little bit of confession to make. Sometimes I just open up the door and stand in front and look at all the beauty that's inside. So when I was looking for a safe, one of the things that I absolutely had to have was I had to have a door that didn't just open 90 degrees, right? I'm in a very tight, tight area here in the back of my mudroom. And so I wanted a door that opened up completely as far as it could go. And this opens well past 180 degrees from the safe door's entrance. And because of that, I can show all of my friends, all of my guns and have them be extremely jealous of everything that I have. Not only are they gonna be jealous of the safe, but they see it and they're like, oh, look at all of it. And they don't know what they wanna to touch first. And that's one of the cool things about this whole entire safe series that helps me stay organized is this safe wall uh, inside the door. Now each pad can hold anything from a Glock 43, right, to a full-size 2011 with a light on it. It's really not that dependent. It can hold something as long as a Strike 1 or a Glock 34 without bumping into or coming up into here. Um, holds revolvers. It can hold anything. And then they've got space down here where you can see lots of extra compartments to put magazines because I have so many different styles of guns. It's hard for me to keep track of my magazines. So I keep like my German magazines in here and I keep my American magazines in here and my plastic mag magazines in here and everything like that. It just allows for so much wonderful storage uh, that allows me to stay organized. Well, I should say relatively organized. I'm not that organized, but the, the safe helps me do that. So let's just pause and see if we can appreciate some firearms, shall we? Glock 43, the Arsenal Strike One Salient Edition, Costa Ludus VIP from SDI, the wonderful CZ P10C, the Salient Blue and Blue C, awesome goods. So EDC 9, ooh. HK VP9, awesome gun. We got the MP 2.0 C. And then last but not least, we've got the Ruger Speed 6 357 Magnum that my uh, grandfather passed on to me. And I know I said last but not least, but this is my carry gun. This is my Glock 19 Tier 1 from Salient Arms, and I just got some new night sights on it, and we're gonna test those suckers out. So when I particularly think about security, I'm not thinking about people who are trying to break in and steal what's inside. I'm thinking about security from a house fire, which is probably a little bit more likely, especially if you have small children. But that's neither here nor there. What I love about the Ironworks series safe is that this particular safe has a 1400 degree fire rating safe for 85 minutes. We've seen pictures where the entire house has burnt down in the Ironworks series safe has gone untouched. And so there's some really key fire points that I wanna go over with you right now about this particular safe. First point is that it has three layers of 5 8 inch fireboard protecting its ceiling, two boards protecting its side and back, and two boards protecting its floor. Second point is that it has this door seal that kind of looks like a cushion that goes all around all the corners of the interior for the door. Now what that means is that in the event of heat or smoke, this will expand to seven times its size, basically like an insulation in between two two by fours in your home. It will fill up all of that space so that there's no heat or smoke or very little heat and smoke that gets in and that could potentially ruin documents or anything else that's in the safe. And the third point is if for whatever reason there is a fire, this safe is completely covered. If it, it fire damages the safe or if this destroys the safe completely, they will pay to have it shipped to them and ship you back a new one or your one that's been replaced. I wanna close by telling you something. This piece right here is not just a safe. It's, a, it's an actual legacy piece for me and my family. And that's what I think is so daggone cool about the safe. Not only is it a piece of like furniture and a piece of art, 
but simultaneously, it is a part of the Fawbush heritage that I will pass on to my son and that he will pass on to his son. So I wanted to thank you for hanging out with me as we kind of looked at uh, this Ironwork Series safe from Rhino Metals and kind of why I chose this one over others. If you're looking for a safe, they've got tons of different safes at tons of different price ranges too. You can have a little more luxurious safes or something that's a little bit more affordable for you depending on how many guns you have and so on and so forth. But they don't just make safes, they also make furniture and they make uh, a lot of different other things that have security blending in with art and time pieces. So give them a look, see, check them out on their website, see what's up and see if there's a safe in your future. Guys, if there is a safe that you're seeing from Rhino Metals that you'd like to purchase, use my promo code, True Exodus. It saves you 15% off. I don't make any commission or anything like that. I just have a platform. I've got one of their safes. And they said, would you like to be able to offer your followers a discount? And I said, absolutely. I'd love that. So if you use my promo code, it saves you 15% on any of the Rhino Metalworks safe. So I think that's a pretty stinking good deal. Check it out. Use it and uh, save some money while you're at it. Well, guys, that wraps it up. I hope that you've enjoyed it. Hold fast. Stay the course. Barrett Fawbush out.